Ah, good afternoon. It's uh, it's a horrible day outside, and as you can probably tell, I've been um, DIYing again. Uh, welcome to my channel. It's uh, Dave's Diaries in France. As you're fully aware by now, my 36 subscribers. It was 37 at one stage, but um, you know, horses for courses. Some people like me, some people don't. But um, yeah, today I've been, as you can probably tell in the background, I've been uh, sanding, uh, smoothing down the walls in the living room of this place. Uh, the walls are terrible. Um, I will be skimming the walls at some stage, but I have to smooth them down first to identify uh, or to, to provide stiction for the uh, plaster that's going on it. Um, just one coat of plaster. I mean, you can see this. They've been painted and yeah, it's, it's just not, not good. But um, so I'm cracking on. Um, I've got nothing else to tell you at the moment. Um, apart from it's horrible outside. It's uh, four degrees today. And um, driving rain. Uh, hideous. But um, this will probably be a compilation. Um, I haven't brought Una with me today, uh, our handy chien dog, um, because I find that when I bring her, I'm always conscious that she's downstairs and she could be getting up to no good. So um, I've come to a compromise that um, I leave her there and um, I take her out and stuff like that. Get her, get her, um, her I was going to say nuptials then, but no, her ablutions sorted. Nuptials, where did I get that from? So, yeah, get her sorted. I leave around 11 o'clock or something like that. And she's okay for a few hours. And I get back for about four o'clock, four o'clock, five o'clock, and she just sleeps. And then I play with her when we get in, uh, take her out and uh, do a bit of training. And um, yeah, I mean, she's, she's fine. And we train her at the weekends as well. Um, but days like this, taking her out, it's, um, she gets very, very muddy. And she loves the dry down when uh, we bring her back in the house, which is very, very funny. I'll have to film it at some stage. But um, yeah, so, so that's where we are at the moment. And um, I may add stuff on, I don't know. But a uh, bit of an update, that's all. And uh, I'll catch you later. Thanks for watching. Give me a like, give me a subscribe. If you like this content, you know, thumbs up, thumbs down, thumbs down. Hey, it's only a bit of fun. Ah, welcome back. Um, welcome to um, Dave's workshop. Dave's tiny workshop. Anyway, um, what's been going on this week? Uh, as apart from the, the, the video update I've, you've just watched, uh, uh, we've had incredible amounts of rain over the past week as well. So uh, I've got some uh, leaf clearing to uh, sort out because uh, it needs sorting out. And I'll give you a bit of video footage of the, uh, uh, the Mayenne River, which has broken its banks on our land. And we are severely flooded. Wow. Not we, but the, the ground around it. Y you'll see. You'll see. Have a look at this vid. So there's our house. Here's our pond, our paddock, and now look at the banks of the Mayenne. You cannot see the towpath. A 
let's go and take a closer look so here we are on a little path coming down there's our old donkey paddock type thing donkey shelter and we're walking down towards the main end <laughs> this is mad the ground is sodden Oop, and slippy wow this is crazy So this is our field, underwater. How far can I go? Mm, that's my limit. Wow. Well, that's my limit. <laughs> I'm not going any further. So. Wow. My gate is submerged. Yeah, I'm going to have to fix that. Yeah. This is just mad. And you, in the distance you can hear the weir. Um, the noise of the weir with the, the, the sheer volume of water going over it. So there you go folks. There's our house up there. You can barely see it through the uh, through the trees. This is just mad. Anyway, catch you later. Who's been?